What? Ow! Oh, it looks no. exactly like the last few dungeons, except it's made of gold. Except that gold is a sickish, pukish green color. It's not gold. It's just really, it's urine. Really dirty walls. It's, it's urine. Eh, it can't be urine. It would have uh, slid hey, off Ted. the wall. Ted, you're in trouble. <laughs> but um, Tish. Matt, that was bad. You should feel bad. I love horrible puns. Thank you for bringing that into our Let's Play. Well, then you're going to love Mega Man X3. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes, all of you watching in YouTube land, we haven't uploaded X3 yet. So guess when this was recorded? <laughs> Hint, it's March 21st. <laughs> you had to the point. Head. You can't. Can't ask a quiz and then give him the answer afterwards. You gotta give him time to think, you know. You know, dude, he could be lying. Have you thought about that? No, I don't think you're lying. For all you know, this could be January twenty second, nineteen eighty five, which coincidentally is three years before I was born. Yeah, so somehow we're all doing, we're all talking about this game while we're not even thoughts. Lewis, if I lie, I lose my paladin st status because I'm not l considered lawful good anymore. No, lying is just fine for lawful good. Look at lawyers. Lying. No, they're lawful not good. lawful good. No, they're they're lawful lawful evil. Evil. No, no. Lying, never being get able to lie get, makes you Get makes your you stupid. Get moral alignments just right. Full stupid. Yeah, that's so. Uh, stupid. Trust me, that's the main reason why I can imagine dating is hard for you because you don't know when to lie and when not to lie. How do you know my dating life? Maybe I've had no, tons of girlfriends. You never know. You commentate over video games on the internet. <laughs> if you're lawful good, <laughs> Ted, Ted, if you're lawful good, does that mean I have to tell the truth when my girlfriend asks, does this dress make me look fat? Uh, well, that's a no-win situation regardless of what you do. <laughs> no, no, no. It's, it's winnable. Very winnable. It's very winnable. Tell them it is, and you'll get But at least they won't, they won't be able to hold out putting out for long. Uh, I I always go with the I always go first off you can't always assume that the dress does make them look fat sometimes they look just fine for the record and uh, also you um, you're always better off not lying because they get pissed if you do at least you're honest when <laughs> and that's that's to be young and nine technically if you want to get picky about it I'm not really lying you don't look fat to me doesn't matter what you look like to like the other two billion people who you might ask and. When a woman tells you that they want you to be completely honest with them, they're more, take it more like as you would a liberal. They want you to be completely honest with them until it's going to hurt their feelings. That's when you got to start lying. So, in other words, don't tell the truth whatever you do. Basically. <laughs> <laughs> That's your social skills. And measure practice your poker face in the bathroom. It. No. <laughs> measure the situation, and then you determine whether or not it's okay to tell them the truth or to start lying. Women think we're liars no matter what we do anyway, so in reality, if you're damned if you do, damned if you don't, fuck it, you know? Practice your poker face in the bathroom. Adam. <laughs> you know, how, how about that Zelda? <laughs> well, what is there to talk about? It's the same <laughs> stuff we've I'm been doing. I'm just trying to keep my mouth moving to drown out this goddamn music. I really yeah. hate these enemies because after you kill them, they turn to bats, which are annoying. Well, they're not hard to kill. It just takes a lot of time if you're not really in the right spot. Because there, now that they've got the, I didn't kill them right away, so they have time to scatter about, and now I gotta go kill them with the boomerang. Hey, Johnny. Just, why Johnny. bother killing them at all? It's it opened like the door to this hate. room. Oh, fuck. Ah. Like, likes. Hate these fuckers. If they if you get hit, you lose your shield, and then you gotta go grind rupees to get another one. Thankfully, I never get eaten by a like like in this playthrough, so I never had to deal with that. But, no, you don't get eaten by a like like, but your shield get eaten. No, <laughs> my I never lost my shield to a like like. Those things are like the gelatin cube monsters from D and D. They eat your stuff. They you look mean like from Wayne's World. But I'm why would you ever get killed by a gelatinous cube? It moves like five pe feet per round. Just sh it, it should never hurt you. They look like those little they pit don't look monsters like they're that ate Boba Fett. Fat either. <laughs> they look like those pit monsters that ate Boba Fett. The Sarlacc? Sarlacc. Yeah, is that what they're called? Yes. It's about the Sarlacc. It's like the Sarlacc, but only uh, exponentially lamer. Yeah. 
Well, I think it's like that old saying, great, I mean, evil leaders and shield eaters have likes alike or something like that. I, th I know that, I think it's something along those lines of why, they, why they're why they called the like-like. Well, all I know is that I don't like-like this enemy, waka waka. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, uh, do Play the like <laughs> Do you like him, or do you like like, like him? <laughs> <laughs> I hate how you have to push the block a specific way to open this. Oh, shut up! I hate everything, you whiny bitch! <laughs> well, I don't... Oh, have you gotten the memo that I don't like this game particularly? It's already up on the TV Tros page. <laughs> yeah, you know, yeah, I've noted it, Ted, and like any other complaint I, I hear, I generally wipe my ass with it. Anyway... Okay, well, let me ask you this question. Do you enjoy playing this game? Honestly, as frustrating as it can get, yeah. Stop walking into the giant seizure ball. They should stop <laughs> walking into me. <laughs> Dude, no, that was you, all on you. <laughs> you. So now we have the stepladder. Well, uh, well, okay, I'm not going to deny the fact that I suck, because I do, but um, to justify my suck just a little bit, uh, it's hard to tell when they're going to change direction in an 8-bit game like this, just because you, they're just the general lack of sprites. It, 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 it's sort of hard to tell what the movement's erratic to begin with, and it's hard to tell when they're going to change direction. Yeah, yeah, I see what you mean. We all, at this point, we all have our one game for this commentary channel that we're just not very good at, you know, forever. I will forever have that Storm Eagle <laughs> old shame alter me forever. I will continuously oh, yeah. land. I can continuously lambast Ryan for Toad Man and his abysmal Sonic Three and Knuckles playthrough. I don't know uh, Lewis at the current moment. Uh, Sonic Six. I have one yet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Sonic Six. What the fuck? Sonic Six doesn't count. Everyone's bad at that game. Yeah, yeah, I'll give you that. But I have to admit, not a lot of people I can easily see get shot to the moon. <laughs> that I did on purpose, actually. What, get shot to the moon, or...? Yeah, yeah, you, ha you have to be, like, in a specific place, which is outside the battle arena in the first place. I exited the battle arena uh, on purpose, um, and by doing that, I locked myself out of the battle, so killing myself was the only way to get back in. And Ted gets manhandled. Ted, it doesn't even look like you were trying. <laughs> no, I was trying. <laughs> you were trying to suck. I, I... Suddenly manhandle. <laughs> okay, um, I, I will say this. I never try to suck. I do I, I do at least uh, attempt oh, to do well. Oh, okay. I thought the game was bugging out. <laughs> <laughs> and, I am grateful we, and I am grateful in terms of restorative magics and whatnot that we have progressed so far from that because... I hear that in the later Raw is exactly Ted going from half one heart to the full meter, and Jesus Christ, is that grating. <laughs> it takes like a full ten seconds. Yeah, I know. Like I said, ten seconds of... Yeah, that's fucking annoying. It's like that bill collector you don't like. <laughs> Any like Vega Beneficiary at this point planet. is used to it. Rupees. In the shape of a rupee. Would have been better if they're all blue rupees. No, they're singles. Like, hey, what treasure is this? It's they weren't better blue, than they were colored. They it's were like colored. finding all of your treasure in copper coins. It's Walking just, to it's the just... waterfall. Wow. No. no. <laughs> How's that, you fucking old? <laughs> Walk into the waterfall. Wipe off the stench of failure. It's at least Ed, that. At least that have to cry. was straightforward. It's not like no. I'm not gonna walk into the waterfall. Why would I do that? There's always secrets behind the waterfall. Haven't I mean, you played a video game before? <laughs> I know, Ryan. What? I mean, I know, Lewis. What the fuck, man? At no, least so, still, why would I do that? Most peninsula holds the secret, or master using it, or you can have this. No, no, no. There's there's something to that though. Ted. If you play Mario World Three, the easternmost secret is the chocolate secret. <laughs> Shut up. Oh uh, yeah. <laughs> hey Johnny, remember on our first playthrough through this, you def and we completely forgotten how to like light the dark rooms up. So then we oh, finally. It's that simple. You, you just had to use HM5 flash. You honest to god, we honest to god didn't even think of doing that. So what else would a candle be used for? Well, hold on for a second, because uh, the first time we played Zelda, uh, on the first time we were recording for the Let's Play channel, I had not played the Legend of Zelda in about four years before that. Yeah. So to my recollection, I only had to use the candle to burn certain bushes. I completely. 
didn't I miss that? I, let, yeah. let me put let me put it this way. Okay, lighting <laughs> torches with a fire that that vanishes after a second makes sense. Lighting an entire room by casting a fire that vanishes in a second at nothing does not make sense. Well, exactly. see here. I just I was just trying to say like do we end. Me and Johnny end up having a real, real big laugh at our joke, like, and thus we learned that the candle could be used to light dark rooms. How do you like that? <laughs> you hey, look, don't say. There is a reason why the beginning of our Zelda Let's Play begins with Matt saying "fuck you" to me, because that was our fifth time recording the game because of both technical issues and just overall horrible playing ability. I just thought that Matt cursed your recordings because every time you've tried to record a game with Matt, something has gone wrong. Exactly. <laughs> God fucking knows how many times Donkey Kong Country took, and I know, I know for a fact Sonic 06 took more than five fucking sittings. Oh, damn it, Blinky Kong. You know what sucks? Yeah. You know what sucks? You. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's another thing. I hate having to grind for hearts every time I du die. Ted, you do that in every fucking Zelda game. And Shit, it's annoying in all of those games, too. So, yeah, nice. I did go back and get out another dun uh, get another potion. So I figured I'd at least explain that without so what? having to show it to you guys. This boss is a lot easier when you have your laser sword active. The entire game's a lot easier when you have your laser sword. Though the laser sword control sucks, because you shoot up. I shoot up thinking that the sword shoots immediately, so I go down to dodge the attacks. But the thing is yeah, that if you move too quickly, God. the sword will shoot in the direction that you move to. So it, it's you have to stand still for a brief second, which is makes me very nervous because I don't like and getting you lost hit your by laser beams. Yeah, for stuff you like that. But I've got enough health at this point that just I can go just go up and just bum rush them. That's what I did. <laughs> it's like you had so much health, you would kill him before he killed you. Right. Yeah, I I, I know how much I suck, though, so I'm constantly nervous when I play this game. Triangle! We have Let's another seizure test in a triangle tree. piece. Freaking a tree. Anyway. <laughs> okay, time to leave this island with no problems whatsoever. <laughs> what? Shit. <laughs> okay, let's try again. You're one of those kids that keeps going out of subspace by sheer accident, aren't you? Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, Ted, oh Ted, Mario 2, you're, sorry. Ted, you're... Yeah, that's the joke. And that's you are among friends, I've done it too. Yeah, sorry, it just took me a second to think subspace. I immediately think of subspace emissary, it's like, oh wait, Mario 2. A good game. I'm better than sex. Anyway. I heard that, asshole. <laughs> <laughs> There's no fucking way Legend of Zelda is better than Final Fantasy VI. I'm sorry. You, now you're just being stupid. Yeah, now I am being stupid. You're right. I'll give you that. This, six is Even better than this, but that's about it. <laughs> I think comparing a turn-based RPG to an action RPG is like comparing water water to, like, steak or something. Steak is made of... Every, the I human like body is made of at least 90% water. Steak came from water. Okay, comparing well, soda to steak, then. The well, point is, liquid. you're comparing two completely different kinds of games. One who likes one does not necessarily like the other. Okay, yeah. Alright, all right, I'll give you that. Anyway. Just gonna now, burn the bush because you can't. Well, I was... Well, I wasn't... I knew that the guy didn't direct me to burn the bush at this point, but I knew there was something there. Because it, it's a pretty odd... That one's at least pretty odd. Oh, fuck <laughs> <pocket>. it. <laughs> the is no, a, a it puts bush. me right here, so I, I, want to, I want to just be able to walk all the way across. But no, I gotta go all the way around. And get butt raped by the yeah, other... Yeah, I mean, I'm sorry, I hate to break it to you, Ted, but when you see a stairway like that, it's obvious you're gonna end up on the other side. <laughs> well, you know, they could just make you appear on top of it. and That's what on I On top of it, on top of a tree. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, no, 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 I, I misunderstood hard. you, that was my fault. I was think. I had to think for a moment what you said, I was like, oh, never mind. Ah, <laughs> this is so picky! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, there's nothing over there. There's a point to those two pieces of wood there. No. no for yes, there is. yes, there is, it gets you to, oh wait, never mind, no. I'm, I'm a little behind, <laughs> sorry. So we're off to what, Dungeon 5? Which one are we on? Uh, I don't There's nothing remember. else to do. We better be heading to Dungeon 5. <laughs> yeah, we're heading to Dungeon 5. Woo. I thought, well, since we have the raft and the step ladder, we can technically explore pretty much everything in the overworld at this point. Not that you need to. 
You want to know what I'd like if Link had a dash feature? That would make going through the overworld a You mean bit the easier. one thing Skyward Sword did right? <laughs> or how about the thing that a Link to the Past did right? Link to the Past did it first. Well, here's the thing, okay? Link doesn't exactly move slowly to begin with, so right. while it's nice, I don't exactly care whether or not I have it. Exactly. Well, he, he moves slower in A Link to the Past, which is why they put it in. Well, yeah. I, yeah, so... Actually, the Pegasus boots were originally used just to solve fun puzzles like you would anything else, but players used it as a dash function, so fuck it, it's a dash function, why not? Hence why I don't consider it one way until we got to Skyward Sword. Ah. Nope. <laughs> I don't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know what you're going for. You're going for the croissant. Uh, that's the strength bracelet, right? Yeah, I'm going for that. No, it's a croissant. <laughs> I'm I pretty sure. Exactly are we Ted, I know. I know when I say croissant and power bracelet. Okay. We're getting uh, the power bracelet, well, the Lewis. Thing it is doubles that your when strength. I imagine eating a lot of croissants. I don't imagine. What exactly does that do? It doubles your attack strength. Oh, good. <laughs> It also lets you push certain boulders, I think. You walked it's, into your own candle flame. It can't let you flame. touch fire. It can't let you touch fire, Ted. <laughs> you walked into your own candle flame again. Why yeah, that did was you my do fault. that? <laughs> it's my own fault, okay? Why did you even use the candle there? There was nothing Because to I felt like it. Maybe my it was apparently it's dark out. We are now in the graveyard. Where even the trees are ash white. No, back up, back up, back no. up. Gonna go all the way around. What are you doing? We're getting the $10 core. You have a guide. And he still gets lost. <laughs> not getting lost, I'm just taking Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. Let me see what you got. Ow, bitch, ow. Yeah, he still gets lost. Must have had his sister playing Much this part. Much of the yellow ones worth. My sister is in a different college than me, several <laughs> miles away. And she's uh, probably better than you. I was making... No, you not really. <laughs> <laughs> Seeing so as which, he hasn't touched a video game since this? Pokemon The magical still... sword. He really? is now fully powered up. No, really? I still don't have just... the red ring, but... I, I meant in terms of attack strength. Just a yeah. magical sword. No master sword, no... There's no master no sword in this game. No the master fancy, sword was a No fancy name game. at all, just... Just magical a sword. magical sword. Really? Lame, yeah. isn't it? Just like the rest of the game. So, Twilight, so Skyward Sword took a shit on the continuity again. <laughs> what? There's three timelines, don't you know? <laughs> the era of dinner. <laughs> <laughs> the king, the era of the king gave Link the dinner. <laughs> the era of squat <laughs> The era of bad jokes. Anyway. <laughs> 